Hello and welcome to Driving with Todd and I'm Todd. So today we're going to listen to some heavy metal. Um, I'm not a big heavy metal fan. I've got a lot of heavy metal music, but I don't listen to it often. Um, I, I buy it if I if I there's a song or something that I want to hear on it, uh, but I don't normally listen to a lot of metal. Why are we going to listen to metal? Well, I've been reading a lot of the comments or I've been reading all the comments in fact that people leave on my videos and I really appreciate those comments and I try to respond to most of the comments but time doesn't permit me to get to every single one I will get to them eventually um, but um, sometimes things get in the way as you know so how does this work um, I got this email from ass duffel Buff. I think that's how it's pronounced. Ask Duffle Buff. Buff. That's the person's handle. And they they like the um, video I did on John Wayne by Brodnicks and Adam Calhoun. But they're asking if I could do some uh, heavy metal. He says, the person says, anyway, as a metalhead, I like to recommend some heavier songs that you'll hopefully enjoy, even though I'm sure it's not the kind of stuff you're used to hearing and he lists a couple of bands and I do have Nightwish um, some of these others I've heard of but I, I don't actually have uh, their their material on CD or, or vinyl or digital so I thought okay um, I'm really not wasn't going in that direction um, but I thought okay the person's bringing it up I thought it'd be great let's 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 do some metal so the group I'm, I want to cover is Apocalyptica now, how did I get this album? Well, Best Buy in the 2000s, like 2003 through about 2010, uh, took their new release CDs of kind of unknown artists and put them on sale for $7. And they did this on a Sunday for one week, and then they'd pull them off, and then the next Sunday they would do another group of CDs for $7. So I'd go in every Sunday and for seven bucks, I mean, that's a pretty good deal. I would buy all of those CDs, take them home, unwrap them, listen to them. Some of it was garbage and, and went to a pile that, you know, never going to listen to again. Others were like dynamite, just dynamite. And I played them over and over. I ripped them. I played in my car. And Apocalyptica, this album, World's Clyde, was one of those albums. It just really threw me for a loop. It was like, wow, this is really some good stuff. So what are they well it's a four person group i believe they're from finland I, I you know don't quote me on that if i'm wrong put the comments in there but from my memory i believe they're from finland there's three people who plays cellos so they don't use guitars they use cellos in the place of guitar and it sounds wild and they have a drummer who's really tight i mean that drummer just kind of drives this group and then they bring in um guest vocalists and there are quite a number of guest vocalists on this album in fact they do a cover of um david boy's helden on here as well and sung in german so that's heroes in in, in german which is a, is a pretty cool song the one we're going to listen to is i'm not jesus and the guest vocalist is Corey taylor and he was a vocalist for uh slipknot and um so and and he was also the vocalist for stolen sour he was in both those groups um so this is a pretty cool song I, I really like this in fact this whole album is just fantastic i mean it was tough even to to pick the one that i wanted to play but i i the one that hit me when i first played this cd was uh, i'm not jesus it's just it's just a cool song so i'm not going go any further we're going to listen to this video um and then go on from there
Okay, awesome track. I mean, that is just that is just a great, great tune. And like I said, when I heard this album, um, it was like, how are they doing this with cellos? I mean, <laughs> this, is, this is like nuts. This is like nuts. Now, to me, uh, yeah, this is heavy metal, but it also has a little tinge of industrial music into it. I mean, there it's got that kind of like harsh edge to it, like industrial music. So it's kind of a combination of the two in, in, in my mind. Um, yeah, these guys are good. I bought a couple of their other albums as well. Their first couple of albums were, they were doing covers of Metallica songs. I'm not a big Metallica fan. I've got a couple of their albums, but I'm just I'm just not a big fan of Metallica. Um, and, and I believe there's no vocals. I didn't buy those albums, but I've got a couple others and, and they're just really good albums. I mean, the way they put this together with cellos and a drummer and then they bring in these guest vocalists who have great voices this guy's got a great voice um like i said i've got a couple of stone sour albums which he's on and and they're they're just really good albums as well so that's apocalyptica i'm not jesus and i have a real hard, hard time pronouncing their name i don't know why but i do and um this is one of my heavy metal tracks if you like this go down below and push the like and um, if you have some comments about Apocalyptica, did I get it right? Apocalyptica. <laughs> um, put, them, put them below. That'd be great. If you have any memories of this song, how it affected your life or things that were going on when you heard it, you know, put that in there too. Give me a little bit of story about your background. And if you have not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe to my channel so you can hear more of this kind of music and uh, give me some more recommendations. But understand that I'll probably be doing, doing those recommendations from uh, the point of how they affected me, the songs that affected me. That's, that's kind of where I'm going with my reaction videos. Uh, with that, I'm hoping you're having a great, great day. I hope you're smiling. I always tell you to smile, so please, please smile. It's really, really good stuff. And with that, I'm done with this video, and peace out, baby.